All right, sports fans, we're here with Chipola men's coach Brendan Foley. How you doing, coach? Good. How you doing? Fantastic. Um, man, a nice ending to the Panhandle Conference season. Uh, had a big win at Gulf Coast on uh, Saturday. The, what, what was that about the uh, 14th, 15th? That would have been uh, the 24th. Oh, the 24th. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm yeah. a week behind. Okay. So the 24th, we finished out at Gulf Coast, 99-84. Um, and how did we do in the league? We did. We finished second, um, okay. solidified second, with nine and three. Um, so a couple things went our way. We could have maybe uh, finished above that, but it, learning lessons. Um, so, you know, but we're going down. We've clinched Mountain State. That's okay. most important. We finished top two um, and have postseason. Okay. So we're, we're headed to, um, to Ocala to play in the uh, FCSAA NJCAA Region Eight yep. State State Tournament, yep. um, and and if you if you're fortunate enough to make it out of there, then you you head to the, to the national tournament um, in Hutchinson, Kansas. So um, on Thursday, March seventh, which is about a week from tomorrow, uh, we line up against uh, Palm Beach. Yep. All right. So how do you, how do you feel about that matchup, Coach? We actually played Palm Beach early in the year, back in December. Uh, we lost 88-83. Um, so we're, we're looking forward to it. They're, they're a good team. They won the, uh, their conference. Uh -huh. Coach McCann does a good job. He's got a good roster, a good team. Um, so it should be a good game. Okay. We're, we're looking forward to it, obviously, from a competitive standpoint. You never, uh -huh. you know, something beats you, you want to play them again. Right. Um, so do you think we're five points better than we were um, in January? I hope so, <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> All right. Um, so that game is on Thursday, March 7th at 6 p.m. And the, are these uh, Eastern times or Central times? Eastern. Eastern. So yeah. 5 o'clock our, um, our time. And the games will be uh, webcast. Yes. And you can go to the um, you can go to the College of Central Florida website. Yeah. And I, we're, do we usually post something yeah, on our we'll website? Yeah, we'll post okay. social media and, and make sure that Natalie okay. puts so that out there. Okay, so put it on uh, Facebook and Twitter and, yep. and also on our ChipolaAthletics.com. Yeah. So look look in any of those places to find a webcast of all the games. So, and um, as if the Panhandle Conference wasn't grueling enough, two games a week, you know, for, for about four rounds, uh, then we also, uh, we have a three-day boom, boom, boom uh, state tournament. So if we're fortunate enough to win the game on uh, Thursday, March 7th, you, you turn around and play again at 7 o'clock our time on Friday night. Yep. And it looks like, the, according to the brackets, we would face either East Florida or State College of Florida. Correct. Um, in, in those games. Do you know anything about those squads? A little bit, but, you know, our focus and attention is on Palm Beach. I'll... I'll give those other teams, a, uh, my, my, one of my assistants, uh, a scout, okay. where they can start preparing for right. them, and, and obviously one assistant will have Palm Beach, but yeah. we're worried about Palm Beach. Yeah, because this is a one-and-done right. tournament. There's exactly. no do-overs. You you uh, you lose, you you yeah. go home, and you're playing golf for a while. Yep. So so we got to take care of business. Um, but Eastern Florida State, State College of Florida, are the other, are the other teams in the bracket? Uh, which, if we advance, we would play them, uh, play the winner of that, and the semifinals on Friday, March 8th at 7 o'clock our time. And then, no rest for the weary, Saturday, March 9th, the championship game would be at 6.30 our time, yep. 7.30 um, fast time. And, uh, Coach, let's talk about getting a team ready uh, to, to, to go through a boom, 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 you know, play, playing three times, you know, in a very, very short amount of time? Well, I, conference takes a wear, and, a wear and tear on you. It takes its toll, especially in our league, as, uh -huh. as grueling as it is, playing each team three times. So we stepped away for a couple of days and, and mentally, physically get kind of recharged, give them some treatment days, let their bodies heal, let their minds kind of uh -huh. get recharged. So we'll kind of get back in the swing of things. Um, you know, I think we have good depth. We, we've kind of... It's the staple of who we are. We work hard. We've set a culture about that. So, you know, three games, three days, everyone's going to have to go through that. Right. Um, you know, you know, as long as mentally we can stay focused and locked in then and stay healthy, then, right. you know, like, that doesn't bother us. Okay. All right. Good. And they are young. Yeah. So they, so they, they, they bounce back yeah. real, real quickly. And Tucker um, will be done. Tucker does a phenomenal job. So right. he'll be with us. And 
Get and and that's that's Tucker. What's Tucker's last name? We Mathis. just call him Tuck. Tucker Mathis, yeah. who is our um, who is athletic our tra trainer. athletic trainer, yeah. and he is fantastic. Yeah. Uh, our athletic director and baseball coach uh, Jeff Johnson. Um, he said he was the difference, you know, in in a, in our national championship, being yep. able to get our pitchers, you know, ready to to come back, and, and so I'm, I'm sure he does a great job with with basketball as well. So uh, he's a, he's a great great part of of the team here. Um, so, coach, we're man, we're so proud of y'all. Uh, again, second place in the league, ended up with a with a win, 26 and four so far on the season. We're ninth in the country, and we're we're third in the state, which right. that, according to, according to my opinion, that might be a little low, but uh, but we'll see how that comes out. Hopefully, we'll end up first in the state after this tournament. Um, but uh, we're looking forward to uh, to seeing how you guys uh, handle handle the state tournament and and this grueling um, little three day deal. And um, we we just wish you the best and and uh, hope hope you, hope you can bring back the state championship. To Mariana. That's our goal. All right. Thanks, guys. Thank you.